Hey awesome admins, have you used in-app guidance yet? In-app's guidance is a way that you as admins can create custom, personalized in-app prompts for your users in Salesforce. You can create them on home pages or list views or specific record pages. You can choose where they show up on the page and what the language is on that page and even what users they show up for. And these are super useful as admins when we're trying to manage change management, adoption, help our users be really productive because it's tools that we can use to communicate about new features, maybe organizational announcements, maybe some coaching or extra information about how they should be using a page. And so we know that this is gonna help our admins be really successful and help their users. So that's why at Salesforce, we created a custom package on the App Exchange that has pre-built prompts for you. These are the prompts that we saw people most successful with. And so we've got pre-built prompts for you that you can then install to get started with in-app guidance and personalize for your org. So let's take a look at how you can install this new App Exchange app from Salesforce and use it in your org. So the first thing we're going to do is install our Salesforce created in-app guidance package that can be found at the URL at the bottom of the screen. This package was built based on Trailblazer feedback of the five most popular prompts or most useful prompts to help your users be successful in Lightning. So I'm going to go ahead and go through my steps to install here in production. And something that's really important is when you install, make sure to select install for all users so that all of your users will have access to these prompts. You can always go ahead and adjust uh, user permissions later on or activate or deactivate individual prompts, but make sure you install for all users on the install stage here or the uh, who has access um, page here. And it should install pretty quickly. However, you might have to wait and get the email for it and check, but in this scenario, it installed pretty quickly. So once it's installed, let's go ahead and take a look. So we're gonna click done and then we're gonna go into our org. So whenever I install any package from the App Exchange, the very first thing I do is I confirm my install packages that it's there. And I always like to take a look at the components that are included. I think this is just a best practice in general um, to be really familiar with <clears throat> every component that's included in any package you have installed. So I can view the package components. It looks like it contains five prompts. Now in setup on the left, we'll type in guidance and we'll actually just go to our in-app guidance page so we can view those prompts in action in setup. I'm gonna turn on wrap text here to make it a little easier to view all of these prompts. So you can see the name of the prompts, like get help anywhere, list view tips, and if I click on the little right arrow on the far right side, I can actually view more details about the prompt by clicking edit. When I view the details of the prompt, it does automatically open the authoring bar and it gives me the pop-up of my prompt details. So I can see the type, it's docked versus floating. Now these are things you cannot change. You can't change the location of the prompt. However, you can define maybe permission, specific permissions that this should be rolled out to. And so if you do wanna control the rollout in that way of these prompts, you cannot adjust the content of these prompts. So you can personalize who sees it and when they see it, but the content and the location, you cannot. If you want to do that, you would want to maybe like copy or use inspiration from these prompts and create a brand new prompt. I can also see the date. So maybe you have prompts that are specific org announcements or things like that that would come up uh, for particular dates. You can define how often your users will see them or how many times. And then when I finish there, I see the prompt popped up as a preview. So any changes I made were saved. And I can see on this authoring bar, so whenever we have the dark blue bar at the top, we're in our authoring bar here. And we can see any other prompts that are on this page. Awesome. So now if I go back to my in-app guidance, I can see all of my prompts and as my users start to like click through these prompts, and any custom prompts you make on your own would be included here as well, you'll start to see how many times they've been viewed, if people are clicking on the URLs that you're including or clicking on the actions that you're including. And this will give you some insight on, are people seeing these prompts? Um, if so, are they clicking on them? Are they helpful? Uh, and you can also reset the metrics if you wanna go into a particular testing period. If you wanna review all of your prompts, you can click that Start Testing button, and you can see this will automatically force a pop-up or all the prompts to pop up on every page that you're on. So that has a prompt. So if I go to Accounts, because Accounts has prompts, I can see that preview here. And I can engage with it like I am experiencing that prompt. So I see my docked, an example of a floating prompt there. 
and I can click in and maybe test my links. So I have links here on the package. We've got links that are opening up those help and training topics for those particular areas. So on the list views prompt, we have some customized help links to say, hey, tell me more about list views and how I can be successful with them. So you can get all of these prompts pre-built for you by Salesforce by installing this package for in-app guidance. It'll really help you get started with in-app guidance prompts, and then we hope that you create some of your own as well. Awesome. So I hope you all are excited to start building out in-app guidance for your users and using this pre-built app exchange package that comes with those pre-existing prompts that you can then customize. And let us know on hashtag awesome admin if these are useful for you or if there's any prompts you're using for your users. And if you wanna find the package or any other details about this, just go to the URL at the bottom of the screen. And we will see you next time.